Hey guys, happy Saturday. I know I've seen you yesterday, but today I am going to make the lemon poppy seed cake mix, which is only available this month. And it just comes in a bag like this. All you need for this one is the cake mix, three quarters of a cup of milk, a third of a cup of oil, and two eggs. And you can mix this up any way you like. Um, I have what I'm calling psychotic raspberry bushes. I cannot keep up. I get three or four of these bowls full every day. I cannot keep up. So I just took a few from this bowl and I'm going to add that to my mixture just to have, so that way it's, it's lemon poppy seed with raspberry. So all you need to do is we start with our milk and our oil. Our two eggs that's all we need in there and it wants you to whisk it together I always use my spatula because I love my Tupperware spatula it's the best spatula you can get so once we have that mixed I'm actually going to add the berries first And we're going to add the cake mix. Oh, as soon as you pour that, it smells phenomenal. It's very lemony. Now, when you're stirring this, you just want to stir it gently because the batter is going to be somewhat lumpy, but you don't want to over mix it. So you just want to just keep going slowly. I'm kind of kneading it at the same time just because I have the raspberries in there this time. Now you can put this in whatever pan you want. It calls for a loaf pan and you can use your, you know, whatever size you like. What I do is right now, because I find that it's so rich and so good and we're trying to cut back on some of our portions. So I use my 13 by nine, not my nine by five. So this is what it's going to look like mixed. Well, I've got berries in there. Now we'll use our spatula. You're going to preheat your oven to 350. And remember guys, this is only on until July, the end of the, this month. So I know myself, I'll be doing a bulk order pretty soon for anybody that's in this area. Um, anybody else you want to get on and do a direct order and get it shipped directly to you. With our technology, it's too bad you couldn't smell this as I was doing it. Okay, so that takes care of that. This is what I have. Now it's telling you, depending on what size pan, it's going to be different with your cooking times and stuff. So if you're actually using the 8x4 and 9x5 loaf pans, like they're saying, they're saying about 55 to 60 minutes or 45 to 50 minutes, um, or basically until your toothpick comes out clean. So you, and you want to cool, oh, my oven's finally ready. It takes forever. So I'm going to just pause this video. Um, instead of making you watch multiple videos this time. So I'm going to pause this. I'm going to get this in the oven and then I'll be back to talk to you and show you what it looks like when it's done. Okay. See you in a bit. Hi guys. I'm back. So this is now done. Um, mine took almost a half an hour, a few minutes shy of half an hour. So this is what we have. Now, if you want to be all fancy, well, this is what I call fancy because I'm not a baker. But you know, Sunset Gourmet makes things so easy for me, makes me look like I'm an amazing chef, I can bake, I can do all sorts of things. Now if I was trying to do any of this from scratch, I can guarantee you 100% it wouldn't turn out. You can ask my sister about that one. Okay. So to me this is fancy. Throw some icing sugar on it, cut it into squares, put it on a nice serving plate, and there you go. 
So lemon poppy seed cake mix with raspberries on this one. I have one more thing to show you and I will be right back. It's now turning out to be a beautiful day. We had thunderstorms all morning and some good downpour, which we need for the fires. But I wasn't kidding when I told you that these raspberry bushes are crazy. I picked these all clean yesterday. And it looks like I'm gonna spend about an hour out here again today picking raspberries because there are hundreds of these suckers. I don't water them, I don't pay attention to them, but it's insane, just insane. So here's my challenge to you. I would like you to send me any of your favorite raspberry recipes and let's see if we can sunset gourmet them up and I will make some of your suggestions. Anybody that gives me a suggestion, your name will go into a draw. Oh, we have some pretty flowers growing in there. We have some weeds growing in there. Anyway, I wasn't kidding about the raspberries. Like I, we get hundreds a day. I don't even pay attention to this sucker. It just does its own thing. And the squirrels are nice. They don't, they don't touch it or anything. So yeah, send me your favorite raspberry recipes. Your name will go into a draw. I'll make as many as I can, try and sunset gourmet them up a bit, and we'll go from there. So enjoy the rest of your weekend. Hopefully the rain that most of us had yesterday and today will take care of some fires and be able to lift the fire bands that we all have. But enjoy the rest of your weekend and enjoy the weather while we have it. Take care.